hello guys welcome back once again this is part eight of how to design social network website now my name is Amor Gwenez. those who don't know me i'm the founder of Eurida Legators and Eurida Hoos so as i said we are going to continue with the tutorials okay so this is our um e-learning community okay it's a social network way of community let me say it's a community website and that is over here members learn how to design professional website and also get a lot of stuff for free okay we have a point system so in case when you create an account i would adv advise you to be an act to be active here uh, you can post you can comment and through that you'll be getting points as you can see uh, we have a blue tick here that is the verified mark as facebook uh do have some and also um twitter okay we also have some here as you can see this guy is having a, a blue tick here okay good and you can check that from his profile too i can click here and his profile you can see that he has that okay good now we are not here to talk about that so if you want to learn uh, how to design a website just come here we have courses here shop here where you can get a lot of resources like templates plugins for free okay good now let's move on we are here uh in our last video we install uh that is body boss theme and body boss plugin okay and um you we, we also uh, did some of the uh, settings and we are going to continue with that we are not done so i have already logged in and now i will go to my dashboard we are going to continue from there we are not going to waste much time here good okay so let's come back here let's go to body boss and let's go to settings okay so we have done we are done with this one the first one here we are done with that okay uh if you if you don't know much oh you can just go to the previous video from part one part two to part one now this is part eight okay good so let's go to um profile so the profile here uh, that is let me open this in a new tab so let me go here now when you come here you can see that uh let me go to my uh, let me go to my profile and as you can see this is the username okay you can only see my username okay good so let's come back here you can see my username because i have not added uh, my details okay so over here let me see uh, let me change them let me edit the profile so that you know what i'm talking about let me go to edit good so name our oh, my first name is ernest and then the last name so the last name is amwako good nickname you read out the guitar you read out the guitar is my brand name so let me leave it like that and save it good so right now let me go to the home page when i put a mouse here or here you can only see a nest good let's go back to the settings now the display display name format is what a nest okay but with this one the display name is what full name okay so if you want you can just go with the full uh, first name and the last name or nickname but uh this time i want to go with the full name that's the first name and the last name okay so let me uh update it let me update it from here and then let's go back here and i can refresh the page and you see that we are now i now have uh, my first name and the last name here okay good now let us continue which name do you want to display okay for i've already selected that so when you change it to uh, that then you will really see that so uh, i want this okay so let's go down and then uh link that is link format okay so that's the user's link format so if i go to my profile uh yes you see this okay that is in case you want to go to i can delete the profile then i'll have member slash my username okay so this the username is fanboy so as you can see when i click that then this is my pro, uh, my profile page okay oh uh, good my timeline as you can see all the posts that are added okay in fact it's very simple and neat okay good so um let's go back here so if you want to have 
a unique identifier like if you want to have and uh, that is a unique name for uh, profile link for all members then you can change it but I want to go with the username okay because so that it will be very something nice slash uh, mem uh, that's the domain name slash members slash then username okay uh, yeah because when you change it you get a name it's, uh, it's some unique name okay good good so let us continue then the proof uh, this is the default one as you can see do you want to keep that I want to go with this one legacy one uh, if you want to go with the custom one you can do that okay but you can add your own custom uh, that is the profile image okay or something like you can go to uh, that is uh, pixabay and then you can download some from there so over here oh why pixabay okay why am i getting this okay i think i'm at the wrong place okay google search google slash Okay, so let me enter Pixabay. Okay, so this one is dot com. I don't know why. Okay, good. So um, let me enter profile. Profile here, just profile, pick up profile. Okay, good. Let's see if I can get something nice, uh, simple. Okay, so uh, let's see. Okay, so if you if you want to go with something like this, uh, let me see, something like this, okay? You can add your own profile, so you can download this. Okay, so let me see, I can just go with this. Oh, come on. Okay, so I will select this one and download it. Okay, I think it is done. Now let me come back here and the custom one, I can now upload it from here okay so i can just select this and add it okay so let me see oh come on okay good if i think i don't like the default one then i can go with this one crop it now i have this uh, let me go down and save it and let's see okay so let me refresh the page here now you see it has changed okay so when i go here now i have something different here good okay let me go down and let's make a lot of so i will go with this one this one is okay good let's see what we can do here allow members to upload a profile okay yes 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 we have to allow our members to upload profile avatar okay okay good and then what else and will uh okay this one don't do that okay it's not uh to me i don't want to do that if you want to go with a wordpress one that is whether you allow that uh, but no i want them to upload it okay profile cover yes and then profile cover too you can also add your default one okay your custom one okay yes like i did uh, this one the profile so that's it then the cover image uh, size you can leave the default one this is the default one or you can go with a, a full width one okay so let me save it and let's see how it looks here okay you see because we yeah because we are using the paid one uh paid plugin that's why we have access to a lot of information here so this is the full one and now i will i will go with uh this thing uh the the this one is okay the default one and then the height when you look at the height here i can make it large okay and let's see oh come on and after that i can just click here and refresh the page and you get it's very it's now large now okay good good so large is okay for me i love that okay good and let us continue profile uh, do you want to have it at here at the left side or on the right on the center one okay so that it will be somewhere here uh, let me save it and show you what i'm talking about okay so i can refresh the page here and now i have it here okay good so let's go down again 
okay good now uh, i think the rest of information please subscribe to this channel like comment you can even share so that others can also benefit from this course action okay so which profile action uh, connection okay connection or messages connection so when you make it connection it means that uh, the action that you will see here is uh, that is close it was none so let's make it connect so that um, members will be able to uh, add uh, send friend requests and so and so forth okay right now we don't have um i am at on my own that is um on my own profile so i will not see that here yes okay so uh the rest is okay in case if you want to create profile type and then the profile you come to that i will give you more details about this one okay good now let's move on to groups do you want to do you want to allow members to create their own group then if the answer is yes allow me uh, allow allow for sending group message to group members if you want members to send group messages that is if you have a group then if you want a member to send group messages does it okay you can allow that okay good what else i want to go with this one and this one too uh, we have already uh, talked about this one so I don't want to explain myself again and this one uh, the default one then large this one is about group the first one we did was uh, for the proof okay that is for the uh, for proof proof but this one for a group proof okay good so and then you go for center one uh, yes yes okay group header okay and then uh that's it okay so the group type do you want to have a group type no i don't want that okay select which member have access to group uh access to create group you can create member type okay so that they, they, you give them the permission to do that okay and also the same thing you can create those things so that uh, you can uh, you can decide that oh this group type will be able to do this this membership type uh, we don't have them right now and so i will have to save this and leave the rest okay because i have to speed up okay now let's go to forum forum to okay do you want people uh, i mean guests to send messages or uh, to post something on the forum no when uh, if you don't have an account at facebook there is no way you can put something there so i will not select this uh, let me go down what else can i do the rest is okay okay the rest is okay the rest is okay yes yes let me go up again okay so okay so i love uh, discussion and reply okay i think the rest is okay so you can just go through it uh, to me it's okay so let me save it uh, i don't want to waste a lot of time here because we have a lot to do activities okay so activities here allow members to edit their activity posts for a duration of okay do you want members to edit their maybe after posting the posting something on the platform for about two days three days do you want them to edit it yes you can do that at facebook right but you can also decide not to allow that okay but mine is forever because that is it means that anytime members can edit their posts allow members to edit their comment for for duration of uh, yes i have to allow that automatic automatically check for new activity posts yes yes so that uh, the moment let's let's go here uh, the moment you start you see uh, it is loading the moment you come to the page you go to the uh, news feed then it will start um, uh, reload all the post for you okay as it is loading now so that's that's what we, if you don't want to refresh the page before it will load for you the automatic one is the best that's what i think activity auto load yes we have to allow that display activity in a separate tab okay uh uh to me it's not the best okay it's not the best okay it's not the best so i will not do that um so yeah I won't do that 
allow me uh, allow your members to follow activities of each other at the timeline yes so that they can follow each other allow me members to like each other activities when links are used in activity pool display image uh, okay yeah that what is it means is that right now i can just enter uh let me show you i can enter https slash eradi host dot com okay so when you see it has reload why uh, the picture is not displaying i don't know but let me check okay so you see now you see this this is what, what we are talking about here okay so when you add a link on the website it will it will it will it will display it okay it will display the image and then the test okay okay restrict the activity feed directly only to push that are relevant to the login member okay so if it is a small let's say uh it's not a large community you don't have a lot of members then i will not advise you to do that okay but if you have a lot of members so that um each member will be able to see the things that he follows he or she follows okay but if you uncheck that it means that members will see all the posts even the posts that are not something they are interested in they will still see it okay good like when you go to facebook if you have been watching videos or yeah videos of um let's say the celebrities who have been fighting on social media anytime they drop a video on that you will see it okay but if you don't follow those things it, it they won't show that to you okay that's what we are trying to uh, the kind of that's kind of star setting that we are trying to do here okay so i will not check this one for now and then uh post okay so here is talking about what post in activities feed we have to allow wordpress and also uh this one we have to allow this okay or the post activity post uh, this one for now let's leave it and apply that okay good so um okay so uh what i can say for now is uh we have done a lot so thank you for watching bye bye